Hello friends, this video on 3 dimensional geometry part 27 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched part 1 to part 26. Let's take one last topic where we have to find the angle between a line and a plane. So if you see, if I have a line, let's suppose I have a line R is equal to E plus lambda B and I have a plane R dot N is equal to D. Correct. So this, if you see, this is the line. So this is nothing but my V vector. Why? Because my the line is R is equal to A plus lambda V. That means this is some V vector, lambda V vector actually. Right? Lambda V vector, I can say. And uh, this is the plane R dot N is equal to D, right? So this guy is nothing but my N vector. Please note, so this guy is a theta, but this is this the angle between the line and the plane? No. This guy is the 90 minus theta is the angle between line and the plane. Please note, if this is the line, so B, B, lambda B is this guy vector and this is n vector, right? So the angle between them is theta, but but this angle is not the angle between the line and the plane. The angle between the line is 90 minus theta. Correct. So in this case, if I say cos theta, this angle is nothing but B vector, n vector, and magnitude of B vector and n vector, right? If you take lambda b, you take lambda lambda here, you get cancelled anyway. So doesn't make sense. So cos theta is this. Cos theta is nothing but sine 90 minus theta. And that is equal to b vector minus n vector dot by minus of b minus of n. Thus I can see that sine of angle between, because this is the angle I'm looking for, and let this angle be uh, alpha. So sine alpha is b dot n by magnitude of b and magnitude of n. So sine of angle between the line and the plane is nothing but b dot n by b into n. Magnitude of b into magnitude of n. Correct? Where my b vector is, my line is a plus lambda b vector and my this uh, plane is r dot n vector is equal to d. So let's take one example on this. We have to find the angle between uh, the line this and the plane this. First I have to convert this particular line into r is equal to a plus lambda b form. Correct? Let's do this. So I have this is nothing but a equation of line that passes through minus 1, 0 and 3. This is minus 1 i plus 0j plus 3k plus lambda into 2i plus 3j plus 6k. This is the equation of the line. And for this plane, I can write as r dot 10i plus 2j minus 11k is equal to 3. I can write this, right? So this is nothing but r dot n vector is equal to d. Please note that uh, this d is not a distance of the plane from center and this is nothing but a plus lambda b. So I know that the angle between my uh, line and plane is sine phi you can say and there is nothing but b vector dot n vector by magnitude of b and magnitude of n. That is nothing but what is b? 2y 3j 6k. 2i plus 3j plus 6k dot min vector n n is 10i 2j minus 11 10i plus 2j minus 11k right by uh, this guy 
magnitude of b that is root of 2 square 3 square 6 square root of 2 square plus 3 square plus 6 square and magnitude of n that is 10 square 2 square 11 square 10 square plus 2 square plus 11 square so if you solve this you get sine phi as 2 into 10 is 20 3 into 2 is 6 and 6 into uh, minus 11 is minus 66 right by this becomes 7 this becomes 15 that is minus 40 by 7 into 15 and we have to take more of this actually so if we saw this further if you take 5 common this becomes 3 this becomes 8 this becomes 8 by 21 so my theta is or phi is sine inverse 8 by 21 this is the angle between this plane and this line correct so i have this line i converted this into the vector form i converted this plane also into vector form i got b i got n i got the angle between b and n and that is the sign of that is nothing but the angle between the line and the plane thank you visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos try free online tests get the best quality study materials study from the best tutors and mentors and much more Thanks once again.